I grabbed a good broad selection of a lot of the different things that we have in our rare book area. And this is from 1916. It's from the Eagle Ottawa Leather Company. So we've got a couple of different colors, the type of skin that it's from. If you look on the back, the grades of it. You know, if you think of somebody who would be showcasing this to potential buyers and even just a little bit that talks a little bit about what the leather was made of. So cool that it has survived this long. I th another one that I think is really cool, which is a catalog for the Silver Dome motorized travel homes. So when we think of the Silver Dome in Michigan, we're thinking of the Pontiac Silver Dome. But no, in Michigan, we were also producing these Silver Dome travel homes. And it's even cool where you see pictures of like the small vehicles that people were using at that time. And, and then something like this also ties in quite well with what we call the Lure Books. This is a publication that's called The Lure of the Land of Hiawatha, Michigan's Upper Peninsula. Starting in the 1930s, this is one of the early publications that were put out in order to showcase the wonderful areas in our Upper Peninsula. Knowing more about like the different hotels and the ferries that existed because this was uh, published before the Mackinac Bridge was constructed. But then other things that we have as well, this one is an 1820 book called The Angler. And what's interesting about this is that it represents four edge art. If you look closely, you can see somebody fishing. And it also shows that books have their own artwork characteristics of them. This one right here, so this is the Michigan Manual for Freedmen's Progress. This is one of those original ones that was published in 1915. And this gives a snapshot of African-American life in our state, developed in 1915 after the 50th anniversary of emancipation and the Lincoln um, Jubilee event that was going on in Chicago that year. And then this here is a set of Michigan manuals and the one that's out here right now, that's from 1837. So this is the legislative manual that state government would have been using right after we became a state. The rules that we, that we were under, our initial state constitution, and also list the names of those that were in the legislature. And just that snapshot that goes well with many of the documents that uh, other state documents that we have in, in the Library of Michigan. It's wonderful that this has somehow been preserved 100 years, 110 years after some of these were started in publication.